Hi, welcome back. Today we're at the Cayambe Kid Park, which is pretty much really cool. It has this really uh, great slides, great uh, maze, and just a lot of great activities, even a, a, a small little lake that you can uh, ride around in little boats. And if you have kids and you're coming down to Otavalo for your day tour, um, a stop here would be great just so that they can have a little fun in the slides and just running around the park. You can also uh, rent some horses in the back and it's a, just a great experience. I love bringing my kid who's actually doing one of those slides right now. He's having a great, great time. All right, have a good one. So after visiting the park in Cayambe and my kid doing a lot of slides and having a lot of fun, we finally arrived at the best bizcocho factory here in Cayambe, and it's the Biscochos of San Pedro. And let's check it out. Come and see how you get in, and we'll see, we'll actually go through how they make them, and you'll see me eating a little bit of the bizcochos, which are just really, really good. Especially the string cheese that they have today, which is good stuff. We also have a little cat that you can play with as you eat and enjoy your biscotto. <laughs> and over here we enter the factory. So this is the biscotto factory. There they're making, check out how they make the biscotto. So we can see their, we can see how they do everything really fast and they make hundreds and hundreds upon hundreds of bizcochos every day. They cut them, they cut the batter really quick and they place them on the, on the trays to be put in the, in the, in the oven. Check out the oven, the oven is right over here. And over here we can see the finished products, which are the tastiest, most fluffy, and most savory bizcochos you'll find in Kaya. So right now, we're gonna have the classic and traditional string cheese that comes with the leaf. Uh, here it's called queso de hoja, which really translates to leaf cheese but it's really a uh, it's really a a string cheese made in this uh, wrapped around with this leaf and it's just really really good let's check it out mm, that's good stuff and if you combine that with the bizcochos you're you're having a great great meal All right, so we were in Cayambe at the park, ate some bizcochos, and then we made our way to the Otavalo Indigenous Marketplace, El Mercado de los Ponchos, as it's known here in Otavalo, and it's just filled with a lot of good stuff, a lot of handicrafts, textiles, uh, blankets, uh, clothing, and a lot of cool souvenirs that you can take back home. None of them are that expensive, and you can always haggle with the people, with the vendors to see if you get a better price. Let's take a look around, follow me around. <laughs> so you can see there's a variety of of things you can buy here. Good stuff. So yeah, Otavalo Marketplace is very colorful 
very full of awesome souvenirs and so as you can see the the marketplace is always filled with lots of good stuff to check out and to shop till you drop and this is just one of the stops that we make it's one of the stops that we make on this tour uh, the other one is going to be to go eat at an hacienda house which is going to be great um, yeah I'll see you later And at the end of the day, you have after lunch and after shopping and and getting to see so many different things and tasting so many different uh, great food and snacks. Uh, the best thing is to just have a, a nice cup of coffee. So I ordered a uh, a beautiful espresso. It's beautifully made. I got a little bit of water and the espresso. And yeah, bottoms up.